Hey everyone, welcome back to Of Ash and Dust. We are back with another episode here today. Here in Crystal Caves slash the Duke's Archives. I was gonna call this Sense Garden. I mean Seath's Garden. That makes even less sense if I wanted to say Sense Garden. But yeah. I have all my Souls games confused. I can't believe none of that hit. Already we are off to a good start. Already this is this is looking like it's gonna be a dope episode because I just got insanely lucky there, I guess. So here is the deal. Um Seath abiding Oh shit. But what does it do though? It doesn't drain your HP, which is good, because I honestly would I would have been pissed if another area had a fucking um, health drain mechanic. Damn, 66k souls. The only thing I'm afraid of is that Seath is going to have like some big twist, and it's going to be like more difficult than normal to kill him I don't know what this mechanic does at all I mean I don't mind if it does nothing so yeah technically he is the last lord uh, but we are of course not gonna be done with the game because we still have the DLC. God, this, this spell fucking sucks. I appreciate the idea. But it's it's not a good one. I can't see... Well, maybe... Maybe Seath is the... Fuck, I hate that. Sliding ass crystal. Uh, Seath might be the one boss where this is actually useful. Never mind though. And they put a one of these things here. I hate these things. All right. Oh, Xena. Fucking Xena again. This guy's a motherfucker. He's weak as shit though. That's the only like Is that the only like saving grace, especially against the fucking like virgin Xena Invader versus Chad Artorias great sword, you know? So yeah, not even gonna break a sweat here. Thank you for the crystal. I guess he is supposed to invade four times, right? And that's how you get the crystalline set. Not that the crystalline set is that good looking. I'm gonna clear these guys out. Oh fuck. Now this enemy is annoying. I still don't know what the hell the thing is supposed... Oh, that was close. The thing is supposed to do. What this debuff is supposed to be. Maybe it that, like... Overburdens you or something? But then again, it doesn't. Alright. Yeah, especially now we have to do this because... First time coming in here. Just I'm kind of afraid of losing a lot of Estus. Yeah, and then pretty much after we're done here, it's going to be DLC all the way. Uh, so we are, what, 20-something episodes in. So we still got quite a way to go. When you think about it. Technically, DLC really is only Manus is left. Oh 
shit. Oh, they're non-hostile. Interesting. God, it irritates me that the arrow quiver goes through the sword like this. And this guy, like... All the characters in these games look like they are always, like, really surprised by everything. They have them googly eyes. It's like... There was a comment on fucking roast me. Reddit roast me. Some Somebody wrote to some guy that you look like somebody stuck googly eyes onto a thumb. And... Yeah. Can we, what the hell is he doing? Seriously, he's going straight for that? Okay, fuck you and your eyebrows. What the hell? <gasps> Are they helping? They're helping. Okay, that was a... Did I just immediately walk into the... I can't even get close to him after now. Okay. Can you like please do some other attack? Thank you. That does a lot of damage. It would be really nice if I could see. Oh, fucking hell. This ca this fight is like very chaotic. The one chance for this spell to shine, it still didn't hit. Or did it? No, it still doesn't hit. <laughs> oh, man. God, this guy sucks. I think, honestly... If you take this fight, like the vanilla version, of, I think after Bed of Chaos, he's the second worst. Like, this guy is just unbelievably dull. Just unbelievably dull, honestly. Which is a little bit of a shame, you know, because he's like hyped up to be the big bad guy, or one of the big bad guys, and it's just not it. It ain't it, Chief. I think this is what you're meant to do, right? It's not like I'm gonna bother with this quest line. Uh, if I'm gonna be a hundred percent honest with you, let's get the 30 and let's get oh shit it's actually quite a significant increase damn okay apparently this weapon scales pretty well off of dexterity which I'm going to take advantage of alright let me figure out where the fuck I need to go um I would like to upgrade my pyro glove. Well, actually, technically. What do I have this thing up to? Plus 11. Uh, and then you have, of course, the like the other tier. Like the super awesome mega power glove. And the thing that I really want to do is I want to try the dream boss with Ornstein. I mean, next to Ornstein, like the Four Lords. Because I think at this point I am strong enough to do that. And I really should... Like, do Painted World and shit. You know what? Yeah, that's what we're gonna... That's what we're gonna do. We'll do Painted World. I mean, we'll try the Dream Boss. And then we're gonna do Painted World after... Getting our pyro glove. 
upgraded. And I guess I can use these. Yes, I'm finally using my consumables. People who have probably been screaming at me since episode 1 to use these. We on a roll now. I'm still not going to use all of them, believe me. I always like to save some. Don't ask me what for. Just towards the end, I like to do a big level up. Oh wait, this is the wrong one. Because the one that takes you to... Okay, I just checked. And I am recording audio. That was fucking suck if I didn't. That's the one that takes you to Blight Town. So yeah, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I was saying uh, Seath. Awful boss. Awful boss. But... It is what it is. We all know what the deal is with them rushing. Everybody, like if you've played Souls, you know the story by heart that they didn't have time to finish. Oh, come on. <sighs> Why am I yawning so much? It's not even late. We finally had our first like decent bout of weather today. It's gonna like continue, so I should be like the opposite of tired, probably because I had a couple of drinks, which for some reason is making me yawn. And it, the fact that I play, I played Dawn of War until until like one a.m. last night slash today, probably has something to do with it. Man, I'm gotten really into Dawn of War now, uh, Dark Crusade. Such a dope game. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, you do that, don't you? I forgot she does that. Yeah, because what's meant to happen is, you know, she's gonna say, do like a big speech on uh, getting you to kill the bed of chaos but we've kind of gotten ahead of that so yeah I've gotten really in, like into the Dawn of War series again it's like it's one of those game series uh, that I kind of just like pick up and play through every once in a while every couple of years I'll play through Dawn of War sometimes most of the time skipping Soulstorm because Soulstorm is kind of shitty but if you're gonna pick up a Dawn of War game, pick up either the original and its expansion Winter Assault and Dark Crusade, those are really good. Good old Warhammer 40k. They still have my Warhammer like uh my miniatures. I used to I used to collect Warhammer when I was like younger. I was a kid, basically. Both me and my cousin were really, really, blah, were really into Warhammer, which was like, it's nice. I mean, it's like, bit of wargaming. It's like, on the nerdiness scale, I think it's second only to like Dungeons and Dragons role playing. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just I think how it goes. But if you wanna. Huff a lot of glue and do a lot of painting. Get into wargaming. I should probably sell those. They're like worth quite a bit because Warhammer is expensive as shit now. Anyways, I'm gonna try this. And it's nice that I have two reserve humanities just in case. So just in case so I was just doing like a word joke but I didn't realize that queso is the cheese I'm like really 
curious on how like easy or still very difficult this is gonna be and if I do beat it what the reward is going to be I think just souls probably cool and I am going to switch out some of them spells. Ire of Flames, oh yeah, this is Meltdown. The question is, do I dare take Power Within? That's the question. And I don't know. I'm taking power within just in case. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. What a brez. Appropriate weapon usage as well, can I just say? You know what my question is gonna be. What the hell is going on? Hey, 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 this is... Why are you guys taking no damage? Is it because I'm using Artorius' sword? Seriously? They thought of that? There's no way they thought of that. They thought of that! Or you can only get these guys with spells. No, but... What? Oh, do they only like phase in or something occasionally? Huh. Yeah, it looks like they like phase into like existence sometimes. This is really strange. That's pretty strange. Okay. I think I'm... Getting the idea of this. Okay, you know what my question is gonna be. Oh, there they are. Can you like not... <sighs> that was a big oof m maneuver here. And it's, you know, you think that the ones, the names on screen is the one you, you can attack. It's not always the, oh shit. It's not always the case. Yeah, so Kieran you gotta be like real careful with. Because she can like, first of all, look at how fast she is. Second of all, she can backstabby stabby you. Or maybe it is the one. Maybe it just glitched out. Whoa, 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 whoa. God, do they have infinite stamina? <laughs> okay. That was a wrestling move. I mean, once you can deal damage, damn, that was a fucking... I got John cena -ed. I don't know if that's what John cena is, because I've never watched wrestling in my 
fucking life. But it seemed like that would be what it is. You know. If I had to take a guess. But she stays... Okay, Hawk. Oh, come on. Hornet. Interesting that she has the most HP. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Thank fuck I was already down. Yeah, this is... You gotta be like... You gotta use this grave to your advantage. Because... The other thing is that I've never really fought Goth in my life, because if you kill Goth in your playthroughs, I don't know if we can really be friends. Honestly. God damn, she's so quick. He's gonna switch right as I get to him. Yep. Didn't I say so? Okay, it's Hornet. I don't even know where the hell I'm dodging. Was an accidental no what oh oh did I get IRL as an offline lag stabbed I think I did okay who are we on Hawk again he's the most dangerous by far no Oh shit. God, I really want to get. No! I really wanted to get rid of her. I'm not sure. I think I might just wait out until it becomes Karen again. Oh shit, that. Because it cycles. Like normally. God. This is quite a quite a team up. Oh fuck. He's right here. Shit, shit. No, no. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay, that might track a little bit more than I remember. Um, fuck, this is difficult. This is difficult. Well, shit. But I think the the like key here is to get Kieran and Ornstein the fuck away from Goth because Goth moves kind of slowly. So like. Yeah, this is this is the way to go, I think. Plus, it doesn't even aggro immediately. I mean, this isn't any easier, but... I'd rather deal with two of them than three. Interesting is Ornstein is the bitch. It cycles through the three of them. Yeah, this is definitely the tactic here. Oh, uh, and then you just gotta like... God, I hate that attack.
it's like really really noticeable how uh, much the fucking okay can it stop being the hawk please can we please get to a point where it stops being the hawk unless it's not timing based if it's not timing based I'm screwed And I think it might... Oh shit, okay, maybe it is. Shit, that's not good. I got a little bit greedy there, I'm going to fully admit that. She's like impossible to get away from. Honestly, I'll take that. I got the heal off. Cool. Okay, I think this is going well. This is go going as well as it can. Okay, you can stun her. She just has a lot. And then, of course, the challenge is uh, not to get insta-body slammed by Goff once we get there. Oh, fuck. I can hear him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. All right, chill. This guy ain't exactly sneaky, so... We got that going for us. Hey, can it switch now, please? It would be really, really good if it could switch, like, right about now. Right about now, yes. Somehow that counted for both. No! Okay. She throws throwing knives as well. God damn, this is like really the double team. You know, she's taking cover under his crotch. Alright. What did I just say about like a minute ago? About getting insta body slammed by fucking Goff? God, this is this is difficult, man. He he Go Goff is the one. Like Goff is the Goff is the issue, really. And it's like I would get rid of him first if I could, but then it's like having two of these fuckers on you and trying to dodge whatever shit he's pulling is just not. Thank you for switching right on the money. That doesn't stack, does it? I don't think it does. I mean, listen, Ornstein is the easiest because he de he deals no damage. Like, absolutely no damage. Karen is a bit more problematic with her bullshit. Yeah, like, speaking of. Get rid of her. Oh fuck. No. Come on. Yes. Shit. Ah, 
shit. Please switch. Please switch to Ornstein. Seriously? It's, it lingers on Goff for so long. Okay, finally. I I don't know, man. I can't do it. This doesn't look that difficult on paper. But, like, when you play it... This is not easy. This is really not... Okay. One final attempt, and then... Honestly, if, if I don't do this, I don't, I don't mind too much. It's just... You know, it's kind of pride... Okay, that's a good start. Of course. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm getting hit by everything. Out of these two, I don't mind who I kill first, really. Okay, thank fuck that still counts. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of crazy how... ...much more difficult Ornstein is. Oh, man, how... How am I not hitting him? There we go. Alright. All we gotta do now is last until Estus blocking Vares off. Which is going to take a while. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, miss, miss me with that shit. Come on. Oh god. Toxin. No! She has a good throwing arm too. And I think what happens is they deal more damage the longer the fight goes on, right? Or something. Because... That's for that move. He knows them wrestling stuff. Can it please switch? Can we please switch? Oh fucking! Ah, I tried to roll through his legs. He, uh, yeah, Goff is Goff is the most dangerous by a mile. <sighs> yeah, this is this is very this is very difficult. Um, for the fact that he one shot, like I've been pretty much one shot by Goff uh, for most of my deaths here. So, yeah, I think I'm going to wrap it up here. I know it was just me doing this boss fight. Um, we'll see. We'll see if I can do this. I'm going to try a couple of more times. If not, whatever, we can move on to the Painted World. And then the DLC, and then we can start kind of slowly wrapping up this playthrough, which is still quite a while away. But we'll see. Gonna end it here. Thank you guys very much for watching. As always, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications. And yeah, catch all of you later. Take care and peace out. Goodbye.